HERO stands for Healthcare Equipment Recycling Organization. We provide affordable medical equipment and supplies throughout the region and globally. HERO really started out as a medical mission recycling organization where all the supplies that were brought in for repurposing really went out to global mission. And so as we grew in our early years, people locally started hearing about what we were doing. And they would call looking for a wheelchair, a hospital bed, a walker, things like that for their parents. So we kind of looked at how do we start serving our local community. If you bring to us wheelchairs, walkers, canes, crutches, things of that nature, we will in turn cleanse them and we actually repurpose them. When I started with Hero, in one year we served 800 individuals locally with, again, those pieces of equipment or even just basic wound care supplies or personal hygiene items. And right now this year, we are filling 450 orders a month. So what, what this little organization, this little dream has turned into is so unbelievable. This year, we are celebrating our 17th annual bash, which is our number one fundraiser for the entire year, and as well as we are celebrating 25 years, 25 years of serving this community, working together with all of our volunteers. We have an amazing staff, and we have awesome supporters as well. Because we're a medical facility, we decided it was not feasible to do a physical event this year. It was safer for us not to. So we're going to a digital platform this year. We will be celebrating HERO all week long. We're going to be doing online and live streaming through Facebook, through Twitter, and through Instagram. We have a fantastic lineup of our silent auction items. We've got already $12,000 in value. The bidding will run through October the 15th at 7 p.m. So you'll have an opportunity to go online and see all the items that we have available. So you can find all that information on our website, herofargo.org, or you can call us at 701-212-1921. One of the things that the BASH has done for us over the years, because it is about 50% of our annual fundraising, is really that financial support. HERO cannot survive and keep our doors open without our community financial support. Our retail center actually brings in about 50% of our budget, and so the other 50% has to come from somewhere. And that's where our community really, over all of these years, has stepped up so much to help us. Our focus is going to be our warehouse project. Back in 2006, we brought in a little over 3,000 pounds of materials. And this year alone, we are on pace to really bring in over 200,000 pounds of supplies. So one of the things that we're really looking at is doing a whole warehouse revamp. We have been uh, in need of having some updates, some upgrades in our warehouse for some time now. We went from a garage to a 1,000 foot square warehouse. We currently have about 2,500 square feet of warehouse. We are at the point where we're growing full speed ahead, but we need some additional space management, some additional racking, some additional shelving that we need. We're looking at getting a new computer system, so we actually are growing, and we're growing so we can be able to give more to the community and globally. And because of the volume of incoming donated supplies from this absolutely amazing community, we were, we were outgrowing our space always. Our warehouse is so overflowing, we just don't have the right equipment to keep up with our incoming flow. We're still working with the original pallet jack from when I started 15 years ago. It just doesn't have the pump anymore that it needs. It's the lack of the appropriate tools in the warehouse um, that we're really struggling with right now because we are expanding so fast and we're just we're running out of room. And so by obtaining better tools, uh, to help that process, I think we can keep moving forward and keep our growth, our momentum going. HERO has a great impact in this community because there's so many people who are not able to afford uh, a wheelchair, a power chair, uh, even um, a bath commode sometimes. People come in and they have great needs and we feel really good that we have uh, available for people the supplies that are needed in the community. And so that's really why HERO exists. 
is really, it's keeping usable medical supplies in the hands of those that need it and keeping it out of the landfill. That's really what it is. Our mission is at the forefront of everything that we do. We enjoy um, the work that we do. We love serving the community. We love all of our customers that we have. And we thank everyone for walking through our doors, for all the calls that we receive. We are also grateful to receive so many donations throughout the year. I personally would like to thank all of our donors for the support over the years. But we wouldn't have gotten to this point if we didn't have great donors, great supporters, great ambassadors, great volunteers, great staff. So truly, 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 we are grateful. I've been with Hero a long time and we have wonderful financial supporters that are still with us in the amount of years that I've been here. Everyone who has provided support to Hero over the years, we're grateful for you and a lot of those names are names that have been with us for 25 years. So, thank you.